Hi, this is Chris with HotHardware.com. We're continuing our look at mechanical keyboard backlighting with the Aki KMG3 RGB keyboard. So this product comes in at just $70, but it offers a lot in the way of RGB lighting. The only other product that even came close in this roundup was the Corsair K70 Lux RGB, uh, but that product has double the MSRP. So in total with this, you have nine lighting effects, including seven gaming combinations and seven color options. Now options consist of wave, multicolor key run, reactive, rainbow, solid, and pulse. So right now we're in the solid mode. We'll dim our lights so we get a better look here. We have it in the multicolor option. In order to activate any of the features, you use the function key and the M1 and the M2 keys. The M2 cycles through colors whereas the M1 cycles through the functions. So right now we have the first person shooter mode active. This is gonna be the pulse mode. We have typing modes here, it's per key. The wave feature. And this is going to be the multicolor key run, but it's set to one color right now. But we can simply change that by pressing the color button. We'll just wait for it to cycle back around so I can show you the multicolor feature. There we go. It's another typing. You have a ripple effect. and then back to solid. We're looking at the HyperX Alloy FPS. We're just gonna be doing a quick overview of the backlighting. Uh, there's no RGB features here, so everything is just gonna be red, and there's no software either. It's all done through a function key on the keyboard. So we're gonna turn off our lights here. And so the first thing you can do is press function. All the keys are gonna be off initially. You can turn the brightness up or down using the up and down on the arrow keys. To cycle through the functions, you're going to use the right arrow. So the first is going to be pulse. The next option is going to be type lighting per key. So each key, as pressed, the LED will light and shine through. The next, you have typing ripple. And this is going to be the wave function. And last but not least, you have a dedicated first person shooter option. And all of these can be dimmed or increased through the up and down arrows. We're we'll looking at the Corsair K70 Lux RGB. We're going to be looking at their backlighting effects using the Q software. So we're going to turn off our lights so you can get the full effect and we're going to jump right into their default options. The first option is going to be Spiral Rainbow. So this one starts out clockwise, but you have the option to change it to counterclockwise. Next we have Rainbow Wave. So this one cycles up through the board. We can also make the colors come down. They can go to the left and to the right. right. Next we have visor. This one ping pongs back and forth, changing colors each time it hits the edge of the keyboard. The next option is rain. This one really gives a matrix style effect. Uh, then we have color shift next. And this one just shifts through multiple colors. Each key is going to be lit with this option. And we have color pulse. 
This one's really popular. A lot of keyboards support the Pulse feature. Uh, the difference here is Corsair has the full RGB lighting, so it's not just red pulsating. And we have Color Wave. This one just sends a wave through the keyboard, and each time it restarts on the left, you get a new color. And we have Lighting Per Key. This one actually registers each keystroke with the color coming through the backlighting. The next one is another lighting effect called Ripple. We've actually got a ripple effect per key that ripples throughout the entire keyboard. And we have Static Color next. This option really allows you to customize the entire keyboard. You can choose to do it per key or you can choose all the keys at once and set a specific color. You can also rotate through multiple colors and they also have an advanced color feature that really lets you choose any color option you'd like. The next one we're going to be looking at is Lighting Link. And this one essentially links all Corsair products. So you have their mice, you have their fans, and their keyboard, and you can actually make them link together. So you have the same colors, the same lighting effects, uh, going through all of them, really synchronizing your entire system. And those are all the default options Corsair offers, but there are a lot of customizable features, colors. Uh, you can really do a lot with this keyboard. Thank you so much for watching.